I've been riding bikes since I was 16 and I've owned quite a few interesting ones over the years. In fact, I've never been without two wheels for long. One of the nicest bikes I ever had was this limited edition Suzuki GSXR 400 that would top 128 and return about 60 miles per gallon. In recent years I've been searching for a sporty and economic 250 or 400 and at last I found one, the Honda CBR 250R and it's not unlike my old Suzuki. What is immediately apparent is the torquiness of this highly efficient single and its relative lack of engine vibration. It's a very comfortable and easy bike to ride and although I love fat rear tyres to be found on bigger bikes, I'm loving the overall good looks of this little bike. Not so keen on the look of the exhaust, uh, the 125cc CBR has a shorter, more sexy exhaust, but I dare say there'll soon be some aftermarket cans to choose from. Now the really good news is the fuel economy is almost what Honda claim, and on my first top-up I was pleasantly surprised and it was much better than the 70 mile per gallon that I expected. I've been riding fairly hard but keeping revs under 9000 and as the bike has only done 600 miles um, I've been reserving the full power for later on but I expect it to nudge the ton. The cruising speed for country roads is ideal in my opinion and on a dual carriageway or motorway with a bit of gear changing can maintain a fairly comfortable 80. The instrument cluster is highly functional as are all the controls. I personally don't object to the digital speedo, I know some people do, and the instruments are very clear at night time. In fact the headlamp is very bright and I think that's an essential safety consideration for daytime riding. Now all in all this is a great bike. I obviously considered the opposition but the build quality and looks alone, I think, uh, put this bike ahead. Mm -hmm.